Guys, what's going on here? Big Yacker. Today we are going to be going over a very inexpensive uh, way to set up your kayak trailer. Um, I found this thing at Academy um, on sale uh, for $18. Um, so, needless to say, I bought two. I'm going to be giving one away to you guys. Um, I've already installed one myself, um, but I'm going to let you guys know the kayak or the trailer that it fits on. Um, and I'm going to give you guys a brief rundown. You guys are going to have to excuse the mess underneath the carport. Simply, uh, I'm trying to do some spring cleaning. And um, it is a mess, so forgive me. But let's get into the video. Alright guys, so this is what we're actually looking at. It's the McCain Trailers Built for the Long Haul. It's a kit that transforms a uh, McCain PT trailer into a kayak and canoe transport. Um, it comes with two load bars, two load bar U support tubes, and all mounting hardware. Um, this thing retails for $149.99. Um, and this is what it looks like on the packaging set up. Uh, this is that spine. This is the, uh, this up here is where your tongue is. All right. And it runs all the way down the center. All right. This is what I was calling the spine. And then it simply just bolts on. And then these right here are actually what your, uh, kayak rests on. This is actually the kit that I'm going to be giving away. All you guys have to do is give me a thumbs up, uh, leave a like, uh, comment in the section below, and please, please, please subscribe to my channel. It helps me out a lot and keeps me motivated to keep going. So we're going to get this guy out of the way now. The Predator PDL is sitting on there right now. Okay. I have this thing bolted onto uh, my spine very easily installed all right it comes with this rubber top right here all right as you guys can see I'm gonna pull it away a little bit um, they're not very they're not very wide bars all right but as long as you either have a set of kayak saw horses that mold to the bottom of your hull or um, you leave your kayak upside down there should be no issue whatsoever, or maybe for a, tr uh, a short transport, or if the hull of your kayak is flat. So, um, I'm going to go ahead and give you guys a better view of it now. Again, you guys, excuse the mess. There is just tons of shit underneath, uh, underneath my carport right now. But this is the actual kayak trailer as it sits. Alright. Now, what I have put on it is these sport racks all right they actually mold to the shape of my kayak um you do have to do a little bit of adjusting um but uh they help as far as keeping the hull of the kayak undisturbed uh, it doesn't i mean i know if you have uh, large indents in the bottom of your kayak it'll greatly deal with how well it tracks in the water this is what it looks like from the rear all right. Like I said, it just keeps the uh, keeps the hull looking nice and fresh. All right, as you guys can see from the front, um, yeah, you'll have some space for uh, two medium-sized kayaks or a large-sized kayak and a small or medium size over there. The Predator is quite large. All right, but this is how I have mine set up, and then you simply run a pair of kayak straps right here over the top over to the other side ratchet it down same thing right here a pair of kayak uh, straps or a set of kayak straps right here and then that's it now I have taken this thing out on the road already um, it handled great 
it worked fine. Um, can't really ask for much more. Uh, like I said, I'm going to be giving away uh, the other set that I got or the other kit that I got. Um, all you guys are going to have to do is leave me a like, thumbs up, um, comment in the section below, and uh, leave me a subscribe. That's literally it. Um, you know, uh, I'll, I'll ship it to you. Uh, I'll get in touch with you after I pick the winner, and um, we'll go from there. So you guys, uh, again, like the video, comment in the section below, and leave me a subscribe. So until next time, um, I'll see you on the water.